What's going on guys, it's Thrill here, and I've got a gameplay commentary for you. And in the gameplay, I go 37-2 and two with a single HS10. And for the commentary, I'm going to talk about the gameplay and a little bit about myself. So, to start things off, I want to say that this is for LGU's shotgun challenge, and it's, it's pretty late. I mean, it's not pretty late, but it's, it's kind of late. So, if this gets posted, I'll, I'll be pretty happy because uh, I honestly didn't, don't think it will. But hopefully, you know it will, so it can help me and my channel. And so my setup here, I should say my setup, I'm using Scavenger, a necessity, with shotguns and submachine guns. And I'm using Sleight of Hand and Marathon with the, I think, the Claymores and uh, Tomahawks and Concussions. And my kill streaks here are the spy plane, blackbird, chopper gunner, because we're not allowed to use the dogs or the gunship. So let me just talk to you about why I chose this setup and how it helps me. For scavenger, it's pretty obvious you need more ammo. For perk number two, sleight of hand, normally if I was using dual wielded on the HS10, I'd use uh, steady aim, because, you know, dual wield. But when you uh, when you only use one shotgun, you don't really need steady aim because you can aim down sight, which helps you get a more precise shot. So I don't really need to use steady aim when using a single shotgun. So that's why I chose sleight of hand. Oh, and I also chose sleight of hand because I knew I'd be rushing and I need to reload fast. And marathon pro, just because uh, you know I need to run run fast and get around the map. I mean, this map isn't that big, but it's good to, you know, get around. You know, what goes around comes around. I don't know why I said that, but that's fine. And the kill streaks I chose because, you know, the spy plane helps you to get the blackbird. The blackbird helps you get the chopper gunner. And in this game, my chopper gunner freaking raped the enemy team. They did not know how to shoot it down. I just got, like, probably, like, 15 to 20 kills with it. It was pretty pretty sick I was just you know mowing them down yeah that's pretty much all about my setup I think oh one more thing I chose tomahawks now this is this is a pretty pretty uh, good tip so you should you know get a notebook out and take notes so when you're using shotguns or uh, maybe dual wielded submachine guns the best equipment to use is this uh, not this index uh, tomahawk because if they're at a distance, you can just, um, since the shotguns don't have a lot of range, you can just uh, throw the tomahawk at the person, but, you know, you need good aim, which means you can't have high sensitivity because then you'd be, you know, wobbling around too much if you get what I'm saying. So, the tomahawk, it gets good, uh, good distance, and I think I was kind of off my tomahawks this game. I don't remember because I've tried this a couple times, and the day I was playing this, I was... Uh, getting some pretty sick tomahawks at a distance and I actually have some gameplays with the tomahawks and shotguns uh, that will go up on my channel in the near future so you should come check those out if you need if you want more help with shotguns cuz the day I got this gameplay I was just like primarily using shotguns the whole day you know spaz olympia and stakeout so I got some pretty pretty good gameplay uh, that will be uploaded on my channel and hopefully maybe if this counts for LGU, and I think this is the first HS10 video, so maybe I'll get a guaranteed two uploads, and then I can upload, you know, a shotgun gameplay. That's pretty cool. So that's that's. I hope I can still get those two uploads. And yeah, I was talking about something earlier before I was talking about uploads. Oh yeah, it was the tomahawk and stuff. Yeah. So oh yeah, and the day I got this gameplay. You know, as I said, I was using the shotguns a lot and getting good gameplays. I was on a hot streak, man. No one could stop me. I was like, I even put on a non-lethal kill streaks for a game, and I still own the enemy team. And in that game where I got non-lethal, when I used non-lethal kill streaks, the enemy team was so bad that I, if I put on, you know, uh, lethal kill streaks like the Blackbird, Chopper Gunner, Dogs, or Gunship, I I bet I could have gotten like easily 50 plus maybe even 60 kills because my team wasn't even that good and the enemy team wasn't that good so that that was that would have been pretty sick if I got a 60 kill regular team deathmatch but I haven't got one of those yet but in black ops I like to play team deathmatch because it's not too long 
So if you go to my channel, you'll probably be seeing lots of Team Deathmatch, but I still play, you know, Domination and Free For All, but not as much. So Team Deathmatch is probably the thing you're going to see on my channel the most. And this gameplay is actually wrapping up, so uh, I thank LGU if the, this actually goes up, because I don't know if it will, it's late. But hopefully it will, because it's pretty sick, as I said multiple times before. But yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, subscribe to LGU. You know, because they're, they're pretty sick, too. Or I should stop saying sick. Maybe I should just say unhealthy. You know, LGU is pretty unhealthy. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, I said that before. Uh, come check out my channel. You know, I have an introductory commentary. Uh, it's explaining what's going to be on my channel and about myself in more depth. So, yeah, it'd be, I'd feel really happy if any of you could just come and stop by and give me some feedback. Maybe subscribe. Any of that. The usual. So, uh, that's pretty much it. Again, uh, have a nice day, anyone who's watching this. My name is Thrill, and goodbye.